Hey there, it's Mallory here with cats.com where we're all about cats and today's video is all about cat wheels. Cat wheels have always seemed like this strange and fascinating thing to me. Uh, I've seen them online and it always kind of seemed like a joke. Why would a cat want to go running in a wheel like this? So to figure that out, I started doing some research and I picked out three popular cat wheels to try out for myself. So we have the ever popular, moderately priced, one fast cat wheel. We have, of course, the Reddit favorite, which is the Ferris cat wheel from Ziggy Doo. And then we have this popular Amazon find from Penplax, which is a smaller, um, slightly cheaper uh, cat wheel, again, that you can find on Amazon. My first step was assembling all of the wheels. First off, the One Fast Cat Wheel was a little bit challenging in terms of assembly, so it connects with these little clips, but the instructions are unclear. Even when I went to YouTube, it was a little bit unclear. They didn't have any close-ups in the video. Um, and they say that you can insert the clips in either of two ways, but I found that they had a tendency to not secure the pieces of the wheel when I put them in one of those ways. So. I had to try to get them out, and then when I tried to get them out, I broke them. <laughs> and I noticed that a lot of other um, people who had tried the cat wheel were experiencing this. Because I broke a couple of the clips, I assume it's a little bit less durable than it could be, unfortunately. I noticed it was a little bit scrapey and noisy when it was running. Perhaps this had something to do with the way that I assembled it, um, but it definitely made a little bit of a scrapey, worry um, sound when it was spinning around. The One Fast Cat Wheel is moderately sized, so the inner diameter is 43 inches, and then that running track is just under 11 inches wide. I tried to get Wessie to play with it, uh, also Forrest, um, and while they didn't really start walking on it, I noticed that my cats really liked the toy that came with it. So they love the kind of bouncy, uh, furry attachment. It's very prey-like, very natural. Um, it also doubles as a laser pointer, and both of them really liked it. So for $249, I think the One Fast Cat Exercise Wheel is pretty well made, and I know a lot of cats and people really like it. Um, my cats were not all that interested in it. Maybe my training program was a little bit lacking. I didn't really take time every day to kind of entice them with treats and get them going on the wheel. Um, but for the most part, it just sat in the living room uh, unused. Next up is the Ferris Cat Exercise Wheel. So far compared to the One Fast Cat Wheel, the assembly of this Ziggy Doo Ferris Cat Wheel makes a lot more sense to me. Oh, Wessie really likes it too. So assembling this took me a whole two hours. Um, I'm not going to claim to be the fastest uh, assembler, but um, this does seem to be in line with the company's um, set expectations of one to two hours for assembly. The part that is the most time consuming was bolting together all of the little plastic parts of the ring. It's a kind of tedious process inserting the bolts, the washers, and the nuts and screwing everything on. What I really appreciated about this cat wheel is that the uh, assembly kit was robust. They offered a nice mallet. They offered a nice combination wrench. Um, the instructions were detailed and they included extra parts, more than I needed. And that was not the case with One Fast Cat Wheel. They didn't include any extra clips and I broke a few of them, so that was not great. Uh, I felt like I was assembling a much higher quality, a much more well thought out product. So it's a bigger cat wheel than the One Fast Cat Wheel. The inside di diameter is 48 inches. The outside diameter is 51 inches. In addition to having a nice rugged ring for your cat to run in, I found that the base seemed to offer kind of a smoother spinning experience. So it has six wheels. Um, the two wheels on the side or on each side or similar to the ones on the One Fast Cat Wheel and the ones in the middle have a lot of momentum and they keep spinning for ages once they get started and I think this contributes to a little bit of a smoother spin. I noticed that it sounded a little bit more quiet and span a little bit more smoothly than the One Fast Cat Wheel. Uh, when it came to the cat test, Wessie stood in it, he follow, he walked in it a little bit to get some treats, and so there was some promise for future training. Maybe eventually, um, if I follow through and keep training him, I'll be able to train him to walk on this wheel. I just haven't had enough time with it yet to make that determination. Now, I purchased this wheel from the Ziggy Doo store for $440. Since then, I found it listed on a different international site for 329 US dollars, 
But the only catch is that shipping to the United States is $280. That means that your total price could add up to over $600. I would recommend shopping around to try to find the best price, but know that it's always going to be expensive. The very last uh, cat wheel that I tried was this Penplex wheel. So I just picked out one of the many similar looking cat wheels available on Amazon and tried it out. Assembly was the most straightforward of any of these wheels, but as soon as I got it out of the box, I could tell that this is an incredibly small cat wheel. So it's almost half the size of the other ones here. You can see how little it looks um, nested inside of the Ferris cat wheel. It seems way too small for any adult cat to run in. The other issue with this wheel is that there's no friction on it at the bottom. It's just kind of hanging on this one little pole. And it seems like it builds up momentum really fast and it's not something you can walk around in. It's just rocking like this weird rocking chair. the carpeted lining can cause snags, and if a cat's claw gets stuck in there, they can have a really scary time trying to get out. It can also be really scary to try to stop it. So I kind of scratched my hands on that outside surface, uh, which is supposed to be kind of a scratching surface, but because it's kind of rough, and also because the wood seems to be unfinished, um, there's a lot of risk of kind of hurting your hands if you try to stop this quickly spinning wheel. So even though I don't think that the pen plaques wheel seems safe or really cat appropriate, I found that Wessie seemed to like it the most of any of the wheels here. Eventually he would just lounge in it and sit there as it slowly rocked. So I think Wessie did enjoy the, the texture of the carpet on the inside, the little bit of the rocking motion. I think this was the one that he was actually the most drawn to, but I just don't think it seems safe uh, or appropriate for cats. And I also don't think it's worth the $232 price tag. So after trying out all of these cat wheels, here are my impressions. The Ferris Cat Exercise Wheel is the best one that I tried. It does cost $329 at least, so it is pretty costly, but the design of it seems to be quite good. You get good instructions, great supplies for assembly, um, and they provide plenty of resources on their site to help you get started. Overall, it just seems like a really well-made product. The One Fast Cat Wheel comes up in second place. It's super popular. Uh, it's pretty well-made. Assembly is a little bit tricky, um, but cats will definitely have a good time on it if they are inclined to use this kind of cat wheel. And then I wouldn't recommend this Pen Plax wheel at all. I really wouldn't recommend any of these little cat wheels sold on Amazon. I would look for something um, that features a nice foam grip on the inside that isn't going to snag your cat's claws, something that's large enough to allow your cat to stretch out. Uh, and something that has nice uh, roller wheels on the bottom. And while my cats didn't really use the wheels, my experience looking this up and doing some research shows that a lot of cats actually do like using them. So if you have a really high energy breed, a cat who loves running, loves just getting exercise, um, a cat wheel like this could be a great option that allows them to do that within the confines of a smaller home. Uh, so I definitely think these could be worth it. You just need to know if you have the right kind of cat before uh, you make the investment. I hope this video was helpful. I had a lot of fun making it. Um, let me know in the comments if you tried any of these cat wheels, if you tried a, another cat wheel, and what you think of them. You will find links to all of the products I tried in the description, as well as links to some additional resources on the cats.com site. So thank you so much, and I will see you next week. Bye.